Hi, my name is Anastasia and in this video I will share 7 habits of highly effective nail technicians. If that's something you want to learn, keep watching. First and most important is learning. Never stop learning. Learn something new at least once a month. Attend different classes, workshops, trade shows. Learn online. Today there are limitless possibilities for that. Like you can literally learn every day, read books, learn more about the topics you're interested in or you think will help you in your job. Let's say psychology, how to talk with the clients, how to attract them and color theory, how to create beautiful designs, salon safety, medicine, etc. Learn from your mistakes. Like Bill Gates said, your most unhappy customers is the greatest source for learning. So if your customers leave a negative comment or they don't come back, just analyze why is that happening and also use it for learning. Like one of my favorite quotes is sometimes you win, sometimes you learn. So if you will learn all the time, you will always have clients and also you will feel more confident about yourself. Just use every single opportunity to learn. Learn from your competitors, from your customers, from your colleagues. And if you will do that, you will see that your life and your job is more interesting every day and you will never get burned out. Number two is related to the first one, is providing new services. If you will provide new services, latest shades, latest colors, latest trending designs to your clients, they will always ask you for more. So remember like a few months, well, maybe it's like a year ago, chrome nails were trending. They were all over Instagram and other social webs and everybody wanted to do them. So once you see or feel that some trend is coming, just make it in a different shades, make it as an ombre, make it with different colors and it will attract even more clients. If you are, let's say, if you focus only on natural nails and you decided for yourself that you are not going to do extensions, still you, there's so many things you can expand within your niche. Like you can provide different products for overlays, you can also find different kind of designs for natural nails and this will make you a unique nail technician. Number three is one of the hardest ones, the one even I neglect sometimes, is free time. Just set some special days you, as your days off, set a special time, let's say you're working from 9 to 6 and after 6 you are not taking any clients, you are not taking calls, you only have a voicemail and use this time only for yourself. From my experience, one of the best ways to relax for nail technician is to dedicate this time for yourself. Let's say you can go to a spa, go to a cosmetologist, you know, do some treatments, have a massage, go to the swimming pool. You know, when you are doing something, when you are a client, that is so relaxing and feels so good because finally you realize that you are not working and now you can relax and even you can pick shades or flavors or something that's really great or you can do something that you personally like just make sure you are not watching nail art videos or doing something with nails even if you feel like you love your job and your best vacation is you know still doing nails after some time you will notice that you're literally working as a robot. We all get burnt out because our brain and our body physically gets tired of this. So the best way to relax is to do something quite different from your job. As we work indoors, so the best way is to go outside, you know, enjoy the sunset, just go for a walk, do everything. And then when you come back to your work, you will feel more motivated and energized and continue working. Number four is using only professional products, tools and equipment. If we are talking about the products, then they should be like monomer should not contain MMA. They should contain only EMA, which is ethyl methacrylate, etc. 
just make sure you are buying from a professional brands and this is how you can secure yourself and make sure they will not cause any skin irritations any allergies to you or to your clients the same with the tools the better tools you are using the safer and better your work will be and equipment let's say if we will take a nail file from best buy or some other shop they are designed for home use home use means that they will do something but mostly they're designed so people will not accidentally hurt themselves professional equipment is different it's more powerful and its goal is to actually do some service professionally because you're a professional and you won't hurt yourself because you know how to work with it so always stick to only professional equipment and product and tools it will make your life and work so much easier and also build a reputation for you next one is salon safety depending on where you're from we all have specific regulations so your goal is to learn them to know all the rules and regulations how to sanitize how to disinfect how to sterilize your equipment your surfaces your salon and do them every single day like what will happen if we will not buckle up when we are driving the car one time well we never know probably nothing will happen but what if in that particular day we will get into an accident you know accidents happen regardless of how good are we are driving or not you know it might happen because of the other people and we cannot ever predict that so the same thing with the safety if you will every single day follow every single rule this in fact sterilize do everything you need to do to clean them then you will know that no single bacteria or virus will get to you or your clients I mean this is our health this is one of the most important things and it's not only about your reputation and the overall look but it's also our health so stick to the rules all the time your clients will appreciate it and also you know it's just for yourself number six have a perfect manicure at all times and yes I know after hard days of working the least we want to do is to take care of our nails we just want to you know relax do something else but this it works like our business card if you don't have time to do extensions and really complicated designs well at least do a manicure and you know cover them with a gel polish or something like that because if you are at the level when you are still looking for a new customers then this is a must have. you need to have nice manicure and nails all the time this is one of the best ads and ways to attract them because you know we always judge people like that and when you go to some trade show or somewhere and you know that this person is a nail technician what the first thing you're gonna look at nails so this is how it works nice manicure all the time and the last one is to inspire and get inspired so read books watch videos follow educators and nail technicians who do inspire you because it really help you to move when you sometimes you know feel sad or tired or distracted after a long day of work when you see someone doing beautiful design or reaching their goals or winning some competition this really brings a motivation and desire to do something like that also and don't think about your colleagues and other nail technicians as your competitors because they are but trust me out there we have enough clients for everybody so make friends with them when you will have friends who share the same goals with you you can learn from them also or you can give them some friendly advice that will help them in the future I will never forget like it was like 10 years ago one nail tech she was really experienced and I was only on my first day of working she gave me a wonderful advice of focusing on pink and white and unfortunately we lose we lost contact but I still remember that like at that moment it helped me so much so if you feel like your advice or just your words of encouragement will help someone just go and do it you know sometimes it might even change people's lives 
so that's all seven habits I wanted to share with you and definitely there's so much more but I think that these seven are the most important and if you think that there are some habits you would like to add please share in the comments and also let me know on which of these habits you want to work on or you're currently working on like for me number three free time is the most challenging but i'm working on it and i hope i will get better thank you very much for watching and remember never stop learning i'll see you in my next video bye help you in your job let's say psychology how to talk with the clients how to attract them and color theory how to create beautiful designs salon safety medicine etc learn from your mistakes like bill gates said your most unhappy customers is the greatest source for learning so if your customers leave a negative comment or they don't come back just analyze why is that happening and also use it for learning like one of my favorite quotes hi my name is Anastasia and in this video I will share seven habits of highly effective nail technicians if that's something you want to learn keep watching first and most important is learning never stop learning learn something new at least once a month Attend different classes, workshops, trade shows, learn online. Today there are limitless possibilities for that. Like you can literally learn every day, read books, learn more about the topics you're interested in or you think well is sometimes you win, sometimes you learn. So if you will learn all the time, you will always have clients and also you will feel more confident about yourself. Just use every single opportunity to learn. Learn from your competitors, from your customers, from your colleagues, and if you will do